turns, throws it back to the corner. Fleury knocks the bouncing puck up against the sideboard. Steele out to the line for Pavelski. Pavelski moves in, cut off, tried to center. Fleury goes down, and the loose puck swept away by Mervis. On the heels of his skates, then Pavelski gets in on the mix, throws on, missing wide of the net before Duhame had to take the penalty. So, Stars power play. First look. Remember, this power play was such a huge part of their win in the playoffs, and they score just six seconds into the power play. Joe Pavelski beats Marc Andre Fleury, and the Wild down one, 57 seconds into the game. On the year, this top unit with just three. But they win the first battle, that's the faceoff, and the Wild don't get out high enough, fast enough, and that allows the three at the top to just play catch until Aiskanen gets a shot at this one, throws it towards the net, it gets through, Marc-Andre Fleury just sits there on a tee for, for Pavelski, and he just... Recovered by Dodana, who sent it cross ice. Now Dodana, back to the line, a shot by Lundquist is loose out front, Fleury down, got a pad on it. Flurry deflects it into the corner. Johansson sends it across for Letary. He mishandles it off the boards. Faxer with a shot. He scores. And the shorthanded goal puts Dallas in front 2-0. Boy, this is just miscommunication. It's all so close from one end to the back of your net in the other end. But Kaprizov just lets this go. Not... Not thinking about what was on the back side there, and that put... And the Wild now staring at a two-goal deficit here at home. Duhame to Foligno, who relays it down into the Dallas zone. Ottinger there to play it for the Stars. Loose puck out front, Duhame scores! <laughs> Well, Evanson getting rewarded after power play. He just puts a four-checking group out there. Dewar does a good job. And Lundquist just throws this one to the slot. No chance Robertson's going to pick that one up on his feet. Good position from Duhame. And the Wild cut the Dallas lead to 2-1. to one. Fourth this season for Duhame. But Dallas now answers at the other end. And it's 3-1 stars. It takes them almost no time to answer the Duhame goal. Matt Duchesne, who's been red hot for this road trip for Dallas, has the stars in front 3-1. Yeah, now this time it's Marchman who gets in on the four check, just wins the battle on favor. That creates the loose puck, and he's able to even pick this one up and threw three sticks out front. Rossi just off the bench as Duchesne slided ahead for Sagan. The end of the corner they go. Spurgeon got it up the boards. Intercepted out front by Brodeen. He leads the charge to Rossi. Ahead now to Letary. A shot off the belly. Scores! Letary goes over the shoulder of Ottinger. His second goal of the wild. And it's 3-2. Well, it's the scouting report. Odd man rush. Letary turns on the Jets. Harley can't catch up to him. Then it's just a perfectly placed shot. It's the release, too. He doesn't load this one up. It's a quick little snap. Ottinger isn't set. Waiting for Letary to get his shot dialed so he can read it. Doesn't get the opportunity. Quick release. Well placed. With the top five scorers on that team. Aside from those five, the next closest guy is 20 points behind. Like it, it was an effective power play. Centering pass, and they score. Johnston with the one-timer from the slot. And a pretty passing play with just 10 seconds left in the power play has Dallas in front by two one more time. Two to the wild. This one goes down low. A quick little touch from Duchesne. Boy, that's a quick passing play. Crisp caught in between. Bogosian is a little bit. Johnson, just enough room to be able to fire this one off from the slot, and it's the positioning there. Tried to feed it across, and it's another low breakaway. This one for Johnston, moving in against Flurry. Pad saved by Flurry! What a stop by the Minnesota goaltender! A game saver for Minnesota, stopping Johnston to keep Minnesota within two. Back 
up high for Lundqvist. Duhame got a stick on it, not enough to clear the zone. Sagan pressured by Letary. Johnston back to the line, a shot, rebound, Johnston, and they score. A third power play goal for Dallas in this game. This time it's Dodonov on the rebound, and it's 5-2 stars. This second power play unit for Dallas now has three goals in the last two games. Johnson redirects the first rebound off a Lundqvist shot to the net, and then Dodonov just finishes it off as... Middleton gives him a shot. Watch a little cross check that puts it on him down, but he's got inside. Power play now for Minnesota. Boldy gives it to Rossi. Back to Boldy. Up high, Kaprizov. Across. Zuccarov scores! Well, power play cashes in for the Wild. Again, they're finding ways to stay in this game. It's Zuccarell. And what makes the play is that he doesn't take long. Like, it's it's on and off the stick in a hurry. You've got the moving screen from Johansson, and if he holds onto that puck any longer. Pavelski to the line. Haskinen. Haskinen looks. Robertson. Forced outside by Spurgeon. Ben back to Haskinen. Wines, fires. That goes wide. Flurry knocked down and they score on the rebound. Robertson in to pounce on the loose puck. And with Flurry down and out of position, Robertson does not miss. It's 6 3 Dallas. They'd like to get going and get done. It's get the power play going. They've done that tonight. Get Robertson on the board on the power play. They do that now. We talked about losing or winning some of these battles around Mark andre Fleury. There's four guys inside the paint, and somehow Robertson comes in. Back to Robertson. Hints. Robertson forced to the outside. Gives it to Haskinen. Robertson, a long shot. He scores! A fifth power play goal for the Stars, second for Robertson, and it's 7-3. to three. three up top, and just isolating the forwards, looking to find a lane. And this one does get through Marc-Andre Fleury. One-timer, not a really heavy shot, not redirected, potentially a late-moving screen. No, you're absolutely right, and... One of the great things about the NHL is there's a lot of games, and if you have a bad one, there's a good chance you've got one the next day or two. Another lone breakaway, and they score. A shorthanded goal for Johnston. That's the fourth lone breakaway Dallas has had on Marc-Andre Fleury tonight. Dallas has scored on. Second shorty of the game for Dallas. That brings their special teams total to seven on the night. But Dallas with... And some... Time for some heavy thought on the way things have gone here the last couple games as Dallas comes into St. Paul and delivers a whooping on the wild. 8-3 the final.